harbour is one of the best places in Australia to see southern right whales. You'll have to come between May and September and it's worth popping into the Whale Centre which has some great information, displays and a lot of history about whaling. Shore-based whaling was a lucrative industry in the 1800s and two whaling stations were established in Victor Harbour in 1837. Whaling at Encounter Bay lasted longer than any other enterprise in South Australia. Wow, look at this. It's a southern right whale skull. It's huge. It's a vertebrae of a sperm whale. Sperm whales can grow up to 18 meters in length. This one is from a juvenile. That's only 10 meters. This sign is the size of a newborn southern right whale's tail. This was the site of one of two whaling stations. Before whaling began, there were over 100,000 southern right whales. By 1835, they had been hunted to near extinction. In 1931, they became protected in South Australia and later internationally. Today, the world's population is just a few thousand.